black holes, the universe's most relentless predators. Not even light can escape their grasp, which is why they appear black. But what about information? What happens to it when it falls into a black hole? Does it simply vanish? In 1974, Stephen Hawking made a groundbreaking discovery that revolutionized our understanding of black holes. He revealed that black holes can actually evaporate. Like a puddle under the scorching sun, they slowly shrink, particle by particle, until nothing remains. This discovery arose from quantum physics, specifically the strange phenomena occurring near the event horizon the boundary surrounding a black hole. The event horizon isn't a physical surface, it's an invisible boundary. According to Heisenberg's uncertainty principle, even this seemingly empty space isn't truly empty. Quantum mechanics dictates that particle-antiparticle pairs spontaneously pop into existence everywhere in the vacuum of space, including near the event horizon. Typically, these pairs annihilate each other in an instant, vanishing as quickly as they appeared. However, at the event horizon, something unusual can happen. If one particle of the pair falls into the black hole while the other escapes, the escaping particle takes energy with it. To an external observer, it seems as though the black hole is emitting radiation, now famously known as Hawking radiation. This process causes the black hole to lose mass over time, a slow but inevitable death. But this discovery raises a profound problem. If black holes can evaporate completely, does the information about everything that fell into them disappear as well? To grasp this paradox, we need to understand information. Information isn't something you can hold. It's an abstract property of how particles are arranged. Let's use an example. Take carbon atoms. Arrange them one way, and you get graphite. Arrange them another way, and you get diamonds. The difference isn't in the atoms themselves, but in the information encoded in their arrangement. This concept scales up to everything in the universe. A collection of atoms arranged one way becomes an apple. Rearrange them, and you get an ant. Information defines the distinction between objects and gives the universe its structure. Without information, everything would be the same, a homogeneous sea of particles. Here's the crucial part. Quantum mechanics insists that information is indestructible. It can be transformed. Burn a book and you get ash, smoke, and heat but the information about the book's composition is still theoretically recoverable. If you could meticulously track every atom and wave of radiation from the fire, you could reconstruct the original book. The information hasn't disappeared. It's just scrambled. This leads us to the crux of the paradox. Black holes challenge this fundamental principle. When something falls into a black hole, all details about its structure, its information, seem to disappear beyond the event horizon. From the outside, the black hole appears to homogenize everything it consumes. But if the black hole eventually evaporates into nothingness, where does that information go? This creates a profound conflict. If information truly vanishes, it undermines the laws of quantum mechanics which state that information must always be preserved. But if information somehow survives, how does it escape the clutches of a black hole? One prominent idea is that information might be encoded in Hawking radiation, the faint thermal glow emitted by black holes as they slowly evaporate over billions of years. Yet testing this hypothesis is nearly impossible with our current technology, as observing Hawking radiation directly remains out of reach. Recently, some researchers proposed that when quantum gravitational effects are factored into Hawking's equations, 
the radiation might actually carry the lost information. This perspective suggests that the equations we've relied on for decades might need rethinking. It's a bold claim, but not yet conclusive. This remains an active area of study, pushing the boundaries of both physics and mathematics. Another fascinating theory suggests that every particle of Hawking radiation could correlate with the information that fell into the black hole. If all emitted particles over the black hole's lifetime were studied, a hidden pattern might emerge, encoding the lost data. This ties into the concept of quantum entanglement, where particles that escape are somehow entangled with those that crossed the event horizon. But here's the challenge. We currently lack the tools to detect Hawking radiation, let alone analyze it for traces of information. And then there's the more speculative idea. What if black holes are gateways to other universes? Could the information falling into a black hole be safely transferred to another cosmos beyond our reach? It's an intriguing possibility, but there's no direct evidence for alternate universes, let alone black holes functioning as portals. Despite these theories, the black hole information paradox remains unsolved. Do black holes completely evaporate, leaving nothing behind? Could information be reflected back from the singularity? Perhaps it escapes through radiation, lingers at the event horizon, or maybe black holes themselves are just misunderstood phenomena. The truth is, we don't know. And that's what makes black holes so captivating. Each answer we uncover only seems to deepen the mystery, keeping us searching for the ultimate understanding of the cosmos.